Winter time can be a tough time for me mentally, but sometimes the winter weather brings in a flurry of 45s from one of my favorite labels that comes at just the right time to pick things up. So let's check out this flurry of 45s from Penrose Record. Records is the West Coast imprint of the Daptone Recording Company, founded by Gabriel Roth, aka Bosco Man. This label is meant to represent the Chicano soul scene in Southern California. Roth started recording in Riverside, California, which is his hometown, with the James Hunter Six, who are a soul-based group that's now part of the Daptone stable of musicians. And he would go back and forth between the Daptone studios in Brooklyn and then mix stuff back in California. And I think they started fully recording and releasing LPs in 45s for from Penrose Records in about 2020 or around there, pandemic and all that good stuff. This is late 50s, early 60s style soul music, often called soldies, with a fusion of some rock elements and some elements of falsetto vocals and just really good music, authentic music. One of the main reasons I'm attracted to labels like Penrose and Daptone is that they are authentic. They still record everything to analog tape and then to 45 and then release LPs. And I plan on going through a whole in-depth video about Daptone talking about their whole process, but Penrose just released this flurry of 545s, all with color variants, which I'm all freak for. And so we're going to go over some of these today. We'll talk about a lot of the artists and just, you know, what you can get with them. And you should definitely pick these up. All of these can be found on Apple Music or on Spotify or on anything like that. But you should definitely go out and get the 45s. first group we're going to talk about here is Los Yesterdays, and this is PRS1015. Now, the numbering system for Penrose is a little bit different than some of the other imprints with Daptone, like Dunham Records. Dunham Records has a parallel numbering system where Daptone will actually have a DAP number along with the Penrose, or along with the Dunham number. In this case, Penrose only has the PRS number, so they don't have a parallel DAP number, at least that I'm aware of or that that's the case. I'm a huge, huge freak about cat catalog numbering and cataloging all of like labels. And that's kind of one of the ways that I collect vinyl with their labels. So I'm interested in that stuff. So if you're interested in that stuff, that's why I'm mentioning it. Anyway, Los Yesterdays is one of the first groups to release anything for Penrose Records. It is headed by Gabriel Roland, the drummer, and Victor Benavidez. Now, I, I hope I get some of these names correct because if I get these names wrong, I do apologize in advance with any of the pronunciations and whatnot. Vic Benavidez and Gabriel Roland started this group in a garage back in the day, and then they just recently kind of like re-dug out everything with Tommy TNT Brennick, who is the founder of Dunham Records, another imprint of Daptone, and Gabriel Roth, who is the bassist. So we got Gabriel Roth on bass, Tommy TNT Brennick on guitar, Vic Benavidez on vocals and Gabriel Roland on drums. And these guys are just awesome. They released another one previous to this called Nobody's Clown, which was really, really good. And they got a video for that. I'm gonna to link to all this stuff in the description below. So definitely go check this stuff out. But this one here is Who Made You You. They have a great video for this as well. They also have this backed with Louie Louie, which is a real slowed down version of Louie Louie. I don't think it's actually the original Louie Louie song, but I think it's another, um, Soldi's version of Louie Louie. Anyway, it is really good. I'm super psyched to have this in this awesome yellow color variant. Penrose has put out all kinds of different types of labels. When they first originally released some of their 45s, you can get pink copies or pink labels of their 45s and those pink labels go for a lot of money i think that was like a short run issue of the very first artists in their preview run of their 45 releases so definitely check out los yesterdays <laughs> next up we have prs 1016 the altons float backed with cry for me now this is on coke bottle green vinyl coke bottle green is my favorite color variant of any vinyl record basically if you're an artist and you release something in coke bottle green i'm definitely going to buy it from you now the altons do have a full length lp called in the meantime which was released on mango hill records in 2019 i have that on the campfire splatter version but there's also an orange crush version which goes for a super amount of money and it's actually very rare to get but these guys are really really good i'm very 
excited for them to release a full length LP on Penrose Records. So hopefully that'll come out in 2023 or 24. I have no information on any of that. So this is all speculation on my part, but definitely go check out this track and its backing track. Next, we have PRS 1017, Johnny Benavidez with Cold Diamond and Mink. We have Somebody Cares back with Slow Down Girl. I don't think that Johnny Benavidez is any relation to Vic Benavidez from Los Yesterdays that we talked about from the first 45, but I do know that this is a Timian Records production. Now, most of these so far have been Bosco Man productions. Again, when we get into the Daptone video, we're going to get into a lot of the production companies that also work for Daptone or the artists that have production companies with them. But Timian Records is a Finland record label that also does a lot of really great, authentic soul music. Nicole Willis and the Soul Investigators, but Cold Diamond and Mink is one of their house groups. They've recorded with some other people like Bobby Arosa, and they've got some of their own records out there too. And so a lot of times you'll see them recording with an artist like Johnny Benavidez, and then Cold Diamond and Mink will release the instrumental record because they were the instrumental group that was backing it. But this is a really, really Thick record. This one here is a purple, purple splatter. It has like a little bit of a splatter to it. There's like a little bit of a yellow kind of like haze, I guess you will. But I love these color variants from Penrose and how they put out these color variants. They're only in limited editions for these colors. So if you want the colors, you got to get them early. After that, they do release the black copies in unlimited versions, you know, forever. But the color versions are limited. So you got to get them and they do actually go up in price after they sell out. So definitely check out Timmy and Records, if you get a chance, as well as Johnny Benavidez and Cold Diamond and Mink. These guys are really, really good. Again, Bobby Arosa recorded with them last year and that released on Big Crown Records. So throwing out a lot of record labels here and a lot of imprint labels, definitely go check them out. They're all, they're all really good. Next up, we have PRS 1018, The Sacred Souls, Future Lover, backed with Four Now. I'm very excited to have another The Sacred Souls 45 in a color variant. You can get both of these tracks on their LP, the self-titled The Sacred Souls that came out on Penrose Records last year, as well as on Daptone Records. They kind of did a simul release with that where you have a numbering for Daptone as well as a numbering for Penrose on that. But there is a variant out there that is only a Penrose Records label variant. It's actually got a blue and white splatter. I talked about it in my vinyl tag for 2022. Go check that out in the description below. Future Lover is one of my favorite songs from the self-titled album. Them. When I went and saw them back in November, it was also a crowd favorite. Like everybody really got down to this tune. So definitely check this out. Again, available in the description below. Go get the vinyl. Really, really good. Rounding out the list here of our flurry of Penrose 45s, we have PRS 1019, Vicky Tafoya, The Moment, backed with Love Don't Treat You Fair. This is one of her newest songs, and if you're not sure who Vicky Tafoya is, she's an artist that's been around since I believe around 2004-ish. Vicky Tafoya and The Big Beat is her group, and they're really, really awesome. They had a previous 45 on Penrose that came out right when Penrose released all their first stable of artists and their showcase that was called My Vow to You, which is like a wedding classic in my opinion. This is a fantastic record, another really great soul track from a really great soul singer. Again, representing that Chicano soul scene from Southern California. This one here on this blue clear vinyl, it's very, very cool that these come out in these random colors. Like I said, you gotta get them quick. But uh, Vicky Tafoya and the Big Beat. I'm not sure if this is the Big Beat. It's just listed as Vicky Tafoya on this one. The previous one from, from Penrose, My Vow to You, was Vicky Tafoya and the Big Beat. So I'm not sure if that's still what they're going by, but very excited for this one, and you should definitely check this one out as well. So that's my roundup of the flurry of 545s that came out in early winter 2023 from Penrose Records, again, an imprint of the Daptone Recording Company. I am a super huge fan of anything that Daptone or Penrose puts out, so you can be sure that I'm gonna recommend them on this channel whenever they come out with anything. I am very excited for all of these artists. I really hope that every one of these artists comes out with an LP soon on Penrose, and 
and I am going to buy all of them and I'll be talking about all of them on this channel. So definitely subscribe so you can see more of these in the future. There's a couple other artists here that weren't in this collection from The Sinceres and Jason Joshua. They're just other artists that I know have already released on Penrose. I can't wait to get more stuff from all of them. I really hope this stuff keeps going and I really hope Bosco Man Gabriel Roth keeps putting this stuff out. I love it. Anything that Daptone puts out or anything that Penrose puts out, I will buy and I will recommend to you. It is really, really good music. And also know that I am not sponsored in any way by any of these labels or by any of these artists. I bought all this stuff, pre-ordered all these records. I I religiously buy all this stuff from these guys. I support them whenever I can to go and see them live, buy any of their shirts or anything like that. I am just a fan. I do not get sponsored by anybody for these things. Nobody has ever sent me a free record to make a video for any of this stuff. So I just want to put that out there and I hope you guys enjoyed this. I have said enough. I'm going to go chill to these 545 from Penrose Records. I will see you guys on the next one.